Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So in this one, I'm gonna show you behind the scenes of a Shopify store that makes approximately 50K a year bottom line profit. In this video, I'm gonna show you a business that takes 10 hours a week to manage, is drop shipping products from China, is advertising those products on Facebook and clearing about $50,000 profit every single year. So it's a business called scalphero.co. This is their listing on flipper.com. They wanna sell this business for 120 grand. It is one years old and their average monthly profit is $3,600. However, if we skip down into the breakdown from the past 12 months, we can see of as of April of 2023, so two months ago. So this is still a current and active business that is currently making a very healthy profit each month. And of April of 2023, we can see they made a profit of just under $7,000. That's not a bad return when we consider they are spending on average two hours a day running this business or 10 hours a week. That truly is the beauty of dropshipping is once you have a validated idea up and running, the majority of the tasks are outsourceable and you can pretty much automate 90% of the business. Not bad then given the age of the store, we can see it's only one year. We can also see it's a verified listing. So these come direct from Shopify and Stripe so they can't be tampered with. So this is a legitimately very successful business all in the very short space of 12 months. Some people might scoff at that. I think it's not a lot of money, but to be honest, I don't know many nine to fives or many paid jobs out there that would pay this sort of money working only 10 hours a week. So it's definitely, at least in my opinion, a business that the majority of people that watch in this video can strive to achieve and are capable of achieving as well. Before we move on just very quickly, I want to let you know about the free training I've just created. It will show you how to start your own online business without any prior knowledge or experience. On this training, I'll show you how to pick a product, find suppliers, build a website and get customers in as little as 21 days. It's 100% free, so if you are still yet to get your business off the ground and you're looking for an easy step-by-step -step process to follow, then you've got to check it out. It's 100% free. The only thing I will ask you for is your email address and and that's so I can send you this. And this is my personal hand-picked selection of 194 profitable product ideas for 2023. So if that sounds good to you, make sure you check it out after this video. It's the top link in the description down below. Some more background information and contextual information. Um, they don't have employees. They mainly use freelancers. These are people that will do one-off jobs and tasks for them, like editing and videography, content creation. Um, inventory is stored at a warehouse, a 3PR warehouse, Ecom Ops. Ecom Ops are based in China and once a customer places an order they should receive it in five to eight days. This is again a massive misconception people have with dropship and they think China to UK is weeks, cheap crappy products. That is not the case. Maybe five years ago, ten years ago, yes, but that is not the case. Logistics have improved significantly. Quality has improved significantly. There is now a greater understanding between suppliers and consumers of what is to be expected. So the way these guys work and the way this setup is, is they order generally 1,000 units at a time and they get it air freighted straight to an ecom ops warehouse which is in china and once a customer places an order it goes direct to them in five to eight days so they still get to take advantage of that beautiful business model of drop shipping ecom ops is a key partner for my fulfillment process they are the ones making it possible to ship our customers straight from china affordably and fast this is also a huge advantage for global expansion because it means you can sell your products anywhere around the world if you can get from china to the uk or china to the us in five to eight days you can probably get pretty much anywhere in the world in that same space as well. And that's also a time period that customers will not mind waiting for. Marketing efforts made so far have been a focus on Facebook and Instagram. I'll be showing you exactly what their Facebook ads look like in a second after we take a look at their Shopify store. Recently, they've started email marketing and having a go at Google advertising as well. So jumping onto their Shopify store, then let's see exactly what a profitable business and store looks like. And um, we can use our handy Koala inspector to see they're using the Dawn theme. If you're not familiar with Shopify templates, Dawn is a free template. You don't have to invest into expensive and complex themes in order to make money. Often simple works best. What they do a really good job of, and it's a common theme through all of these stores that I review, is that they are branded. So we can see they have their custom designed logo and we can see that very same 
using custom design logo on product packaging. We see another custom and original photo with the logo again on the packaging. This is all original photography, original content unique to this business so nobody can copy this and it also sets these part, sets these guys apart from the competition. Let's have a look at the product page then because even though they're using the Dawn theme which is a free theme, they have a lot of apps on here um, to really customize the product page. This is not a Dawn theme traditional layout. If we take a look at some of the apps they've got um, installed, Gem Pages is one of those. Gem Pages is a great tool because it allows you to take any theme out there, no matter how basic it is, um, and make it look super professional like this. Just to point out some of my favorite features then, something that you don't see a lot of other Shopify stores doing, which really, again, just helps these guys stand out from the competition. I can't stress enough how the biggest battle in dropshipping is being better than everybody else, and I think a lot of people forget that. So number one is with every order, they get a free gift. If there's another business out there selling this product, then you don't get a free gift with that business. You're gonna come back and order from these guys because you do get a free gift. These guys have custom packaging, which shows they're a more professional and established business. Again, if it was a choice of going with another business, which is white labeled, or these guys, which are private labeled, these guys look so much more professional. And again, you're gonna come back and shop with these guys. So there's already two additional reasons to go with these guys. They have a 60 day guarantee when most people offer 30 days. They're working with e ops or 3PL, which means they can offer five to eight day shipping. So all of a sudden you've got this business, which is custom packaging, is branded, has an extended guarantee. You get a free gift and you can get it delivered in five to eight days. Whereas you have a traditional or normal drop shipping business, which is one to two weeks, is white label, no custom packaging, only 30 day guarantee and no free gift. It's just an absolute no brainer. These guys can sell this product for 10, 20, 30 dollars more than anybody else. But because they have these things I've just mentioned, it means that they will win the buy from their market. As we move down then, just to stress and iteration on how well it's branded with the inkeeping of different colors, the way everything is really visually pleasing, the way everything is original content imagery they've taken themselves, these little custom icons and different statistics and things like that, it just does a really really nice job of positioning themselves as the professionals the original sellers and the best people to buy this product from sometimes what i find when reviewing these stores it's not a case of what information you put on your store but it's how you present that information a lot of stores will have the same sort of information but unless you present it in a visually pleasing and professional manner like these guys sometimes it doesn't land with the same impact or same effect and that's where you lose your conversions on your store let's jump into the facebook ad library then again another common theme with a lot of these stores i review that are very successful is that they will test and test and test and they will have many, many, many different ad creation variations or many different ad variations. So this is simply from June of 2023. All of these ad ads here are simply from June of 2023. So it just goes to show the extent to how much they are testing to try and find what works. Let's jump onto this one then and take a look at exactly um, what this ad looks like. So another common theme, I've said that quite a few times, um, a lot of successful businesses will start their ad creators out with a quotation. So my scalp suffers from dandruff and I found improvement after five times using this brush with shampoo. This particular um, variation is used in 21 other different variations. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the actual video itself. So that's quite a, a gross introduction, <laughs> scraping all the dandruff off this person's scalp, um, off their skin. But what it does is it sucks people in really well because that sort of like grossness gets people watching sort of thing. People have like a natural instinctual thing to want to watch and keep watching. This is obviously some user generated content from different people they may have paid um, to produce this. Perhaps it's themselves showing how you use the program. Got some custom animations. Everybody's smiling, it's uplifting and happy music. I'm not sure if you can see that. Again, some more custom animations just to show almost the science behind the product. Three different quotations there, or just snapshots of different things that three different people were saying about the product. So all in all, a really good and effective ad creation obviously goes without saying, um, producing some good results for these guys. Let's jump onto a different ad creative and selling a different product. So let's go for this one. Um, again, they followed the same pattern, starting off with a testimonial. Um, let's take a look at the video ad for this one. So that's the first couple of seconds. Hair secret most Americans don't know. So straight away, it naturally raises somebody's inquisitiveness, if that's even the right word. And what they have, as we can see, is lots of different people using the product, talking about how good the product is, pointing out the different benefits of it. And all in all, as we can see, a very, and there we go again, custom packaging in the hands of the person, which matches the page and branding 
that's advertising it they actually show their website as well so they have that level of familiarity and know what to do where to go and what it's going to look like when they want to make a purchase another business that followed that same pattern was twinkling tree they did the exact same thing they had an influencer actually go onto the website and film herself placing a purchase so it almost kind of puts that into their into their brain into their vision hopefully you can understand what i'm saying and not just sound like a complete idiot um but it works something i've actually seen people done do before is have this arrow actually pointing to the shop now button um, which is something actually quite interesting which i might consider testing myself as well and so with that being said guys i think i've pretty much covered everything um when you're running a successful business there's four main things involved there's the products there's the supplier there's your store and there's your ad creatives um, i've shown you all four of those things so it is a really kind of good look behind the scenes I guess of what a successful business looks like there's a lot to learn from this I hope you've stuck with me I hope you've enjoyed watching the video and more importantly I hope you take what you have learned and put it into action and it helps you replicate some success of your own and with that being said I'm going to wrap the video up thanks for watching guys don't forget to check out my free training the top link in the description down below don't forget to subscribe if you want to tune in weekly and watch similar videos to this any comments questions video suggestions put them down below in the comment section I read every single one so I will see it and I will get back to you thanks again guys hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one on Wednesday stay. Cheers.